uh, in Mercy Street, you play a Civil War doctor. Which side? Well, I'm a union loyalist from a slaveholding family, so it's complicated. Uh huh. Yeah, it's a uh, fun little contradiction. Which side do you come down on that war? I think the right side won. I do, I do, I do. do. Think, okay, I think just want to make sure. Nothing against our southern friends, of but I, not. I do think the right side won. Okay, just want to make sure how yeah. short I should make this interview. Um, <laughs> Uh, what is in your doctor's bag? You know, is it just saws and whiskey? It's like some bone saws, some, some morphine. My character's got a little issue with the morphine. Oh, um, back then it was delicious. It was delicious. It was like a little morphine for you, yeah. dealer takes one too. Yeah. Very nice. And what I found out, you know, the, you know how they use methadone to get people off heroin? They yep. invented heroin to get people off morphine. Really? Now, this has not worked in, throughout human history. But uh, how did that's you, what like, how do you train to. You know, like people do ride-alongs. How yeah. do you train to be a doctor? Are you asking war? me if like, I what, did morphine? <laughs> I didn't. Mm -hmm. I talked to some people. Um, no, but ha but like, what what are the sort of things that you had to learn about being a doctor back then? Well, we, it really was a lot of chopping off the leg. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah. It, you know, it's not like doing uh, playing a doctor now where you have to, you know four years of medical school, four years of residency. It's like they can tell you in ten minutes what they knew. You know, so. What did, like, it be, what did it take to be a doctor back then? Well, you would follow like a country doctor around for like two months, and he'd be like, "Congrats, you're a doctor." <laughs> or you would really? go, Here's, "Here's your jar of leeches." Exactly. <laughs> you would go hear these lectures, and then a year later, you'd go back hear the exact same lectures, and they'd be like, "Congrats, you're a doctor." And it was it wasn't even a super prestigious profession. It was kind of like I brought my character brought shame to the family by becoming a doctor, which is not how it is today. No, it's not how it is no. today. No, no. Matter of fact, did anyone in your family want you to be a doctor? Uh, a lawyer. A oh, lawyer. Well, my father's a lawyer. Okay, yeah. yeah. My father he's okay now. He's oh, fine. Yeah. He's with fine. What with I'm doing now. Yeah. My father was a doctor. My father was a doctor. Yeah. I thought, but I don't have the science for it. I didn't either. I, I, I couldn't do it. You don't have the science for being. I a can lawyer? act. I can approximate. I, I know things about medicine. That's what I do on the show, and I, I'm always doing this with my hands. It's weird. <laughs> yeah. I'm good at acting like I'm smart enough to do yeah, things. Yeah, 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 yeah. But you know, you'd have the bone, you got the bone saw, the Lister knife, the Catlin knife, a couple sutures, some morphine, chloroform, ether. That was it. Yeah. Yeah. That's, where, that's when men were men and dead at 32. <laughs> that's right.